This is the Dollar Tree that I come to most often, so I'm just going to take you in and see if they have new items. I hadn't been here in a little while, so let's go on in and see if they have Valentine's. Well, I can already see it through the opening here, so let's go in. The last time I was in all of this area here was cleared out, so this is all Valentine's Day stuff. Some little felt stickers with diamonds that are great for crafting or decorating little Valentine goodie bags. And the stickers here are pretty as well. So I spotted these at the other store as well, the craft bottle, but they're not, they're just plastic, they're not glass. Ooh, you can do a lot with one of those boards. Oh my goodness, these things are massive. You're like little heart doilies, which are great for wrapping the outside of a pocket letter or even decoupaging. I did a cute DIY last year with some lace or you can do it with a doily. These are fuzzy. I think that's supposed to be a unicorn. a unicorn deck it looks like a cow unicorn <laughs> it's the funniest little thing ever oh my goodness scented stickers scented stickers and lots of little crafting packets here so you've got like table scatter but what I love about this is it's not like look at it it's all sparkly on both sides and then you've got your little foam little message hearts talking hearts Oh, this is super cute. Some of these pieces are so worth it because I was at Michael's and shared with you like the fairy garden aisle. And oh my goodness, their prices were so, so, so expensive. So if you're finding these things at the Dollar Tree and you're into making little fairy gardens, oh, well, this one here looks like it's broken. So just be careful. Although you can use it like that. It looks super cute too, but it is supposed to have a little door. So here's a close-up of this big love sign. Oh my goodness, this is awesome for transformations. It looks like it lights up, but it doesn't.
these are newer mugs and um, I know that they're kind of in the Valentine's Day line but definitely can be used any time of year. I think these are the cutest gnomes I have ever seen. Dollar Tree really has nailed it with them. I love their little behinds. Like they're just perfect. The detail in these are so wonderful. And then again, you can use um, like these little flower and garden metallic pots, but especially this one here, you can even set up as a little fairy garden or as a centerpiece of some sort. Just gonna go through because the succulents are out and all these new little, the terrariums just going to share with you what I see here. Wow, these flowers are absolutely gorgeous. Do you see them? I'm going to see if there's some more here. These are really pretty as well. I love this color. Ah, there they are right up at the top. So hard for me to get up to. This is new to me, the unicorn. Let's see what else is in here. So I'm dropping things. Ah! I bought a roll of this ribbon when it first came out. I just love the pearly iridescent on it. And there's always nice tissue paper here that you can decoupage like gift boxes or anything like that and transform them into storage little boxes, kind of similar to something like this, but where you would have a shoe box and then just put some pretty color on it on the outside. But these mermaids are so pretty. I also always like to take a peek at the storage just to see if there's anything new. So these little foil garlands are perfect because they come with little dot, like they're already pre-cut little circles. So these are wonderful for embellishment making or anything really in your craft room if you're into paper crafts. Just gonna go take a peek at the puzzles. I also like to use puzzles for ephemera. So if there's anything that's pretty, that has like the nice colors that you're looking for, then you can also use little puzzle pieces for ephemera and for craft making. These little confetti packages are wonderful for making shaker pockets, especially in pocket letters or even just like shaker embellishments. These are really, really great for that.
Nice to see the Armor All brand here at the Dollar Tree. So if you're looking at putting together a little gift basket, um, even for Father's Day or something like that, collecting some of these products would make a lovely basket. As I've mentioned in previous Shop With Me's and Hauls, sometimes you will find the bonus pack so you'll have three sponges instead of two. So definitely um, when you are browsing through, make sure you take a peek for that because they will have bonus packs. So I've purchased the apple one before. I'm going to try this cherry, I think. I've used the apple on um, little can for little turnovers. Oh, I had spotted these salad dressings at uh, the previous store I had gone to, and so they're here now. And clothing! Okay, so I'm going to finish up this video here because it's always hard when the video is a little bit long for me to post to YouTube. So I'm going to say goodbye. I hope you guys enjoyed part one of the shop with me, and then I look forward to posting part two for you. Till next time, have a wonderful day. Bye for now.